Hello and welcome to what I call a new video, and today we are going to be playing chess. I, I'm also not actually playing chess. I'm, I'm, I'm simply commentating over a chess game that I played recently. And uh, this this chess game was a brilliant move farm and a great move farm. There have been in a total of <laughs> eight great moves and three brilliant moves by one side, except one great move who was played by the other. But nevertheless. We start. I'm I'm a fan of the Danish Gambit because uh, I, I I I do I do just enjoy myself a little bit of Denmark, and it plays right into it, you know. And then he does that move, which I've actually I've actually never seen uh, that move being played. Uh, do what, something incorrect, okay? And then he, someone ignores an opportunity to fork pieces, and then whoops, and then whoops, <laughs> whoops again. <laughs> We are not very good at this whole playing chess thing, however, I have an advantage over here. And now, I can just straight up take. I, I can just straight up take the pawn with the pawn, take the pawn with the queen to get a queen trick going. But no, what do I do? I do that. <laughs> See, what I was trying to do is try to get him to take, so I take back and then the queen is, uh, you know, <laughs> right there. However, I didn't see that. I didn't see this knight. He, he can go back. There's, there's a bit of a whoopsie right there. Nevertheless, uh, he takes, I take, not realizing my my, my, my failure. Fortunately, he realized it. <laughs> it, was, it was an unfortunate day, okay? Then I take, take, I check, check blocked, I do, I go back. And I gave up a rook. I am truly the best chess player of all time. Completely boxed in. All he has to do is castle away. But wait a minute. I can now take this pawn, and wait a minute, that was a bad fucking move! Because if I use my knight and go on a little merry-go of adventure, then I can simply take this goddamn bishop. Bad move! I get my knight in there, and brilliant move! He did, he did think about it for a long time. He did think about it for 30 seconds, and then made a brilliant move, sacrificing the queen. Because I am down so much material that sacrificing the queen really doesn't matter. It is unfortunate, but what can you do? Uh, the alternative is uh, being, you know, <laughs> is the bishop being taken and the king being unable to castle. So this ensures that the king will be able to castle and also gets rid of a knight. So then a little bit of a trade, not good for me. We're now six in the favor of the black position, which is unfortunate. However, we move. Unfortunately, I, I, I tried to do a little bit of a, you know, <laughs> an attack on the knight here because, you know, it's, it's, it's kind of nice. Uh, however, I, I, I failed to realize that uh, this guy... <laughs> This guy is this guy's a maiden one if I do that. So uh, naturally I had to uh, pull up the pawn. Then I take the pawn. Hey, I I, I won a pawn. Who, the, how do I do that? I don't know. Anyways, so now we do a little bit of a forced move. Well, it wasn't forced, was it? No, it was. Everything is all right. Excellent move. My pawn is now one square away from promotion, and he puts his rook there. How? I don't know. Why he did that, I don't know, but then I did an inconsistent <laughs> accuracy as well, so it doesn't matter. Brilliant move! Sacrificing the rook! I mean, whatever move can you do? Nevertheless. <laughs> I take back. That's right, I find the move. Plus, attack on the knight, he's out of here. Dead. Deader than a goddamn dead person. <laughs> and now all I gotta do is keep pressure on the pawn without being able to be attacked by this guy. So naturally, I am attacked by this guy with another brilliant move! <laughs> God damn it! Naturally, I take. I I'm pretty sure the best move here is actually going right there, so the pawn can't promote. And then I do that, but I'm trying to do perpetual check. What I fail to realize is that after the first check, going here is in the line of sight of the queen. So that's a whoopsie from me. I just move a little bit. Oh, wait a minute. Best move. And oh... Hell yeah! This allows me to do perpetual check! Oh, hell yeah, baby! It's about that time! That's right, that's where all the great moves come from! Because every time I check the king, it's a great move! Woo! You love to see it. You honestly, you honestly love to see it. Then we get our great move to end the game in a draw. And according to the website chess.com, I played a 1050 and uh, my opponent played like a 1000. I'm officially 50 elo points above him. This, this is so stupid. I blundered both of my rooks.